So one of the areas that we're seeing the most activity at the moment is the automation of a company's transfer pricing cost allocation model. And the purpose of the model is to allocate a company's central costs across a group. And this needs to be carried out at an arm's length basis based on a company's chosen TP policy. And historically, this process would be carried out in Excel using multiple workbooks and involve a lot of messy data. It's a time consuming process and can often take a couple of weeks to complete. When carrying out this process in Excel, it's quite easy to make errors and there's no real audit trail. So there's no way to check if someone's accidentally typed over a number. And a reliance on key people with in-depth knowledge can also develop as it's often hard to understand what's going on and how the costs are being allocated without relying on these key people to help. And using Excel for the allocations doesn't let you easily model out different outcomes as the process is just built to focus on getting to the right answer. So by using Alteryx, it's made the whole process faster. It takes about 10 seconds to run. And it's now automated, so the client doesn't have to keep carrying out the same repetitive processes over and over again. Alteryx also leaves a clear audit trail, which is also useful when handing it over to the auditors and can make your life a lot easier. And as you'll see later, the audit trail gives you confidence in the model. And Alteryx never touches the source data, so you don't need to worry about someone accidentally editing the numbers. We've completed a number of these projects and have combined the key elements from them in this demo. And usually we receive a lot of messy data, but we've stripped it back in this example to help highlight the key principles. So in this example, we have three inputs. So we have this table um, that shows the central charges for each cost type. We then have another table that shows the allocation method to be used for each of these costs. And here we'll be allocating based on revenue and headcount, but any number of methods can be used. And then finally, we have the data showing the revenue and headcount figures for each of the entities. And as you can see, these inputs are in different formats and would require a fair amount of manipulation before being able to easily join them together in Excel. And in the workflow, you can see that um, Alteryx can easily input multiple files and it can also connect to some ERP systems, which prevents the need for finance teams providing custom reports as you're able to draw down the data directly from the source. Alteryx can then clean up the data before joining it together. And you're able to click through each of these tools to see exactly how it's manipulating the data. And this is where it leaves that clear audit trail as you're able to see exactly what's happening at each stage of the workflow. And you're also able to group and document the workflow to explain what's happening at these stages as well. And then once the data is joined, the workflow then carries out the calculation and allocates the costs across the entities. And then once this has been built, you no longer need to touch the workflow and can package it into an analytic app, which looks like this. And so all this means is that the person running the uh, process can now interact with this user-friendly interface instead of having to go back into the workflow each time. And all you need to do is select the input location where the data is stored, select the markup percentage you want to apply to the calculations, and then choose where you want to save your outputs. And then when you select finish, the app will run the workflow behind the scenes, and it takes about 10 seconds to produce the outputs. So using the app makes this whole process even easier to run and also means you can dynamically interact with your workflow without needing to go back into it. So in this example, you can update the markup percentage. So you might want to try 15% instead of 10. And so then you just need to change the number and you can rerun the app and Alteryx will produce the new output applying the updated percentage. So this makes it easy to run different iterations of the model. And for this example, here are the outputs that Alteryx has produced. And as you can see, it's now allocated the costs across all 20 entities. And as well as this, Alteryx has also produced an output with the corresponding journal entries that would be required. And you can see here, it's made about 1,400 of them in about 10 seconds. And it's also produced an output that can be used in any visualization software. So this makes it easier to analyze your data in an interactive way. And again, you can see that there's about 6,100 roads that have been produced. So you can see that Alteryx has produced a lot of data in a short amount of time. And as I mentioned earlier, it's easy to run different iterations of this by changing your selections using the analytic app. 
And Alteryx is also really flexible and it's possible to create other outputs. Um, for example, you can create invoices for these charges as well. So moving back to the visualization aspect, here's an example of a dashboard. And visualization tools such as Power BI are easy to use if the data is in the correct format. And this is where Alteryx can help. And using Alteryx also enables the automatic refresh of data so that your dashboards are always kept up to date without needing to manually produce them every time. And having your data in these dashboards means that you can interact with it in various ways to help spot key trends. So here you can see that since 2016, the legal costs have risen. So that might be something that you want to look into. The allocation model has a wide range of stakeholders. So by having a single source of truth and a visualization tool results in huge time savings as everyone is able to access and interact with the same data. And once your stakeholders start using these dashboards, they'll never want to go back to receiving Excel reports again. So by automating this process in Alteryx, we've enabled our clients to go from running a time consuming and resource heavy process that they run about once a year to now being able to run this on a monthly basis to track their allocations throughout the year. And this has resulted in our clients having a better understanding of their data and enabling them to make data-driven decisions.